What's good out there guys? It's Roll Easy here and I'm back with another GTA 5 online video. In today's video, we are going to be going over the gift cards to friends glitch and I'm actually going to do it on Xbox, okay? I haven't done this gift cards to friends on Xbox because it was super tricky. It's way better on PS4, but I needed to show the Xbox guys some love since, you know, there's no frozen money on Xbox. And by the way, that's still working for PS4. So now that we've kind of gotten that out of the way, what we're going to be going over is how to hit this efficiently because on Xbox, like I said, it's tricky. So this works on both consoles. What you need is an MOC with the personal vehicle storage with an RH8 inside. You need a friend to give you a car, obviously. Have him sitting in a different session over at the docks with the car that he's going to give you in a different charging mode. So I'm in free aim. My friend is in assisted aim. Then you also need another friend in a different targeting mode for later, and this is mostly on Xbox. And, um, and we're going to be using this as a money glitch in this video because there's really not much for Xbox right now when it comes to glitches, especially money. So if you're using this as a money glitch and you're going to sell these cars, what you need to do is actually you and your friend need to have the same custom plate in your iFruit, and that's the, that's the plate that you guys are trading back and forth. Okay, that is very, very important. All right. And uh, yeah, your friend that's giving you a car also needs an MOC. So those are all the requirements. On Xbox, you don't have to worry about different, or sorry, PlayStation, you don't have to worry about different targeting mode because you guys are using the recent activities. So this is how you set up. Call out your MOC personal vehicle, which is my RH8 right here, and set your spawn location to last location outside of your bunker. Now, what you want to go ahead and do is hold down on the D-pad and flip to a story mode character and just head to story mode. This is how you want to reset before you get every single car. Okay, this is very important to reset it this way. You, It, it is much more efficient on both consoles to actually hit it like this. Okay, so at this point, once we're in story, go ahead and press pause, go to online, go to play GTA online and go into an invite only session, close friend session, whatever you would like. Whatever is a little bit easier, you know, if you don't have to, if you don't want to worry about invites then do a close friend session, you guys can just join each other through the party nice and easy. So as you can see right now, I will be spawning down right in front of my bunker with the RH8 that is parked in the bunk or in the MOC. So just go ahead and hop into your RH8. You can use a Fagio also if you really like to, doesn't totally matter. I just like using the RHAs for this glitch. So once you've gotten your RH8 or your Fagio, just drive into your bunker. All right. And that's what we're going to do right here. So here's where the tricky stuff starts. So on Xbox, we need to join our friend that's giving us a car that's over at the docks, you know, in a different uh, session in a different targeting mode. We need to join him and get the different targeting mode alert. But before we get that first alert, we need to hit right D pad to go into the MOC. Now it's tricky because alerts just are just random when they come in on Xbox. So you're going to see right here what it takes. All right. I got the volume up so you guys can hear exactly what's going on. So I'm going to go ahead and press the dashboard button, go join my friend, and I'm just going to press on join game and then look how fast that loads up. That load that loads up super quick. If it loads up that quick, you cannot whatsoever uh, press right D pad right now. You have to wait. You just have to wait for the, you know, the blue circle to come back. Now it's back. So I can go ahead and dashboard and I'm going to try to join my friend again. All right. So here we go. Take two. All right. Any second now. There we go. All right. So I press on it once, close the dashboard, but look, the alert comes in too quickly once again. All right. So it just doesn't, if the alert's coming in that quick, you're not going to be able to hit right D pad. That's just the reality of it on Xbox. It is super, super, you know, touchy when it comes to this. So on this one, I noticed whenever I join my friend the third time, it takes longer. So watch. So I pressed it twice there and look, I'm just going to wait. I have a timer because I know how my console and invites work, you know, and around 10 seconds, that's when the alert comes in. So I'm going to press right D pad before the alert comes in. Boom. So I press a on the first alert and then I sit on the second alert. Now you want to sit on the second alert for 45 to uh, 45 seconds to two minutes. You hear that banging in the background that only happens on Xbox for some reason. On Xbox, you want to wait till that banging stops. If you want to have your radio on, that works too. But uh, you guys on PS4, this is way easier. You're just using a recent activity. You just right D-pad, double tap the PS button uh, and sit on the recent activity. Okay, that's literally all you're doing. So PlayStation, it's much easier. Xbox, we got to hit this timing. But if you practice enough and you know when your alerts come in, it's not too bad, all right? So right now, you can still hear the banging noise. In a second, you're going to hear it all just clear out. So 
So you hear that? It's just like a constant noise. You can go ahead and deny the alert when you hear that, okay? So I denied the alert, and as you can see, I'm stuck on the animation. You must wait for that banging noise to stop, all right? Once you're in this animation, press pause, go to online, go to the criminal enterprise pack, then once you've clicked on it, back out of it. Now you can open up your interaction menu and you can take the easy way out, okay? So now that friend that we were just joining, remember I said you want him to be at the docks, spawn location, last location in another session? So that's what I'm going to now actually invite my friend. So we're getting glitched out. I mean, it's not really solo. It's solo on PlayStation, but not on Xbox. So we're getting glitched out right there without actually having him in the session. So right now, all I did was send him an invite. Since the spawn location is set to last location, he will be spawning over at the docks with the car that he's going to be giving me. Now, remember, we're using this as a money glitch. So he has to give me a car that uh, with a custom plate that I also have in my iFruit. We both have the Rolezy plate in our iFruit accounts. So that's the car he's going to give me. See, he's giving me a retro custom. If you're giving cars, you know, to sell, make sure that they're Benny's vehicles. So now what we're going to do is he's going to go ahead and just hop in the car with me. He doesn't have to do this. We're just going to drive away right now so that he can actually request his MOC. All right. So have your friend request their MOC. Now, we actually both had to get out of the car because if you get that message that says your MOC is not empty, you both just have to get out of the car. OK, just get out of the car and then he'll be able to request it so I'm looking away because the spawn location for the MOC is right behind us you know you want to make this as efficient as possible nice and easy so there we go his MOC just spawned in I'm gonna go ahead and actually just drive him over there and just drop him off and he's gonna run in there all right so just by himself you're gonna sit here with his car because this is the car we're gonna be getting so he's gonna go ahead and run into his MOC uh, I was too close we so had to hit enter alone right there but uh, yeah so now he's in his MOC and he's gonna send me an invite inside of his MOC so it should be coming up uh, right now in the bottom left. There we go. I'm going to open up my phone and accept the invite. So at this point, you are stuck on an infinite black loading screen. PlayStation, you can just start up a recent activity and deny the alert. Nice and easy. Xbox, we need to join a different friend that's in another targeting mode. So I'm in free aim. I know my friend Saints right here is in assisted aim. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and join him. Uh, don't mind for some reason right now. I like, I don't know. I went to go join him and then I wasn't sure if he was in a different targeting mode. So I went to go try to join him again and it kind of screwed it up. So that's what you're going to see right here. I should have just accepted this alert and then denied the next alert. But, uh, yeah, I end up just, you know, trying to join him again real quick. So I wanted to see if this would work on Xbox. It's, it's a trick we do on PlayStation for different targeting mode. But anyways, yeah, it just put me back on the black screen. So now I'm just going to do it normally. I'm going to go ahead and just go to go to his name. You know, the guy that I know that is in assisted aim. I'm in free aim. So I'm going to go ahead and join him. The alert's going to come up right now. I'm going to accept the first alert, decline the second. Boom. All right. Now I'm in the car. You see in the bottom left, the radar is all screwed up. You're like OTR and you have loading in the bottom right. You just simply want to wait. All right. Just wait on the screen. Sometimes this can take, you know, 30 seconds. I've been I've sat here for a minute and a half before. It's uh, it's all very random at times on Xbox. I think it's a little bit longer. I've been doing this glitch on PS4 for a while and it doesn't seem to take as long as it did on here. But basically, you just wait here for some people right when your radar comes back to normal in the bottom left. You actually get sucked into your MOC with your friend's car instantly. For other people, the radar will come back and then you have to wait an extra 20 to 30 seconds um, after that to actually get sucked in. So we're going to see right here what happens. And look, the radar was literally just about to come back and I just got black screen. What's going to happen now is I'm literally just going to spawn right in my MOC. There we go. All right. So I have just gotten a car from my friend just like that. So this is the best glitch to do right now on Xbox. Obviously, it's a gift card to friends. You can get aircrafts with this. You can get special vehicles. You can pretty much get whatever you know vehicle from your friend that you want with this glitch. That's what makes it great. And on Xbox, this is actually, sadly, the best money glitch that you can do right now. All right, there's really not much to do on Xbox in the world of glitches at the moment. So make sure, I'm gonna show you right here why we do this with a custom plate, okay, that we both have in our iFruit. So he gave me this car with a roll easy plate and guess what? I have a roll easy plate as well in my iFruit. So I'm going to show you that right now. If you take the car to LSC and you go to the plate section and you still have all your custom plate options, you're good. You see that it actually took the place of the roll easy plate right there. It thinks that I have my own plate on, which is good. This is a clean car. This is actually sellable. I wasn't planning on selling it. And then I'm like, you know what? For the video, let me prove that this is, you know, something that I would sell. You know, I'm not lying to you guys. So I drive right back in and I actually sell the car right in front of you. So. 
yeah that's how you do this glitch guys okay so obviously on ps4 it's much simpler you only need one friend on xbox you do need kind of you know one friend to help you and give you a car and then you need an extra friend in another targeting mode i mean he doesn't have to know you're joining him but i definitely recommend on xbox being in a free aim you know session while doing this glitch most people play in assisted aim all right so that will benefit you but uh yeah so that's gonna be it for me guys i hope you enjoyed the video my name is roll easy subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by hitting that big red button turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope gta 5 online content i'm hoping to make another video soon about our new rolled goal so stay tuned for that thank you for 25,000 subscribers see you in the next one guys